it, it, is, <laughs> it is remarkable, the breadth of offerings that we have, both in the religion program and in the philosophy program. And, it, and it's remarkable primarily because um, we're providing that broad range of offerings, of course, as, um, with, with you know, very few faculty in philosophy and very few faculty um, in religion. So there's no question I've had to stretch a lot. Um, you know, personally, I've had to stretch a lot to teach. You know, I, I teach introductory philosophy, of morality and moral controversies. I teach logic, ancient Greek philosophy, um, the early modern period from Descartes up through Kant. I do advanced courses on you know, philosophy of law, um, advanced seminars dealing with issues on freedom and responsibility. So, um, yeah, I, you know, every member of, of our department has a, has a wide breadth uh, of knowledge um, that we can use for a teaching base, um, while at the same time, you know, in the summers when we're engaged in our research, we, <laughs> we zoom in on something um, in particular. Uh, one of the things that Co is especially good at is like, finding these diamonds in the rough. <laughs> and a lot of these students that are diamonds in the rough, they don't even realize how good they are. And then we take them uh, and, you know, that we take them as good students, we turn them into excellent students. They never dreamed when they came in the co that they would end up going to graduate school at places like Harvard, Princeton, Yale. They never dreamed that they'd go to the Chicago Law School. Um, and by the time we're done educating them um, in this sort of, um, thoughtful and, and yet non-snobbish way, <laughs> these students, they end up going on to doing great things. Um.